Over 5,000 miles separate the venue from Tali Marmon and Stella Gerda's home countries. And I love my country. We have everything from everything. Like all cultures, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. So it's like a mixture of things. Um, people are really open-minded and that's my favorite thing about it. I'm proud of my country. I'm proud that I'm Greek. It's like very small country and when I came here it was like big difference. I was like, oh my gosh, where am I coming? For Stella, volleyball became an innate passion as she followed after her Olympian father. He really helped me during past years to improve myself, know how to have more like experience. I know that when my dad is talking to me, I know that he's saying the right things. Taking two years away from volleyball, Tali represented her country off the court. Going to the army is a duty in my country, like everybody has to serve. It's an honor, like you go there, you do girl serve for two years, guys serve for three years, and it's something that everybody has to go through, it's an experience. When you're playing with your country, you feel special. It wasn't like exactly like, you know, high level, it was like young ages, but you know, volleyball is volleyball. This is something that motivates you since you're young and you start playing volleyball, so that was my best experience, like wearing the uniform, singing the anthem. That was great. Head coach Todd Dagenet and his staff have embraced his players' cultures and used diversity training to educate themselves and the team. There's a lot of support on this team. Learning how to see the world through somebody else's eyes is difficult. Learning how to walk in somebody else's shoes is really difficult. They'll never be able to walk in somebody else's shoes, but what they can do is try to understand what it's like for them to walk in their shoes.